dark and bitter or creamy milk. Chocolate is a $50 billion a year business. Whether a romantic gift or a decadent treat, it's been made and consumed for more than a thousand years. But now scientists say they're a step closer to creating the perfect chocolate. The cocoa bean from the cocoa tree is its key ingredient, and researchers are on the verge of releasing the tree's genetic blueprint. By mapping the cocoa tree's genes, scientists hope to identify key traits in its DNA. This will allow them to breed, or more controversially, genetically engineer high-yielding plants with greater disease resistance. Such an achievement will come with big financial rewards, so it's no accident that some of the research is being led by chocolate maker Mars. The scientists have so far generated around 400 million bits of information. They must now work out which of these are associated with particular traits in the plant. Eager for any advance that would see the quality and volume of their crop improve, more than six million cocoa farmers, many like these in West Africa. Two-thirds of the world's cocoa supply comes from here, but blight frequently wipes out entire crops, costing growers more than $700 million each year. If the DNA data can identify and breed blight resistance into a new generation of cocoa plants, farmers say their profits will leap and with it, their quality of life. Mars says it won't be patenting the information and will make the raw data freely available to the public online. What's less clear is whether it will make public the results of its efforts to identify the flavour genes, something they hope will see them create a scientifically perfect sugar high. Tarek Basley, Al Jazeera.